Hello, hello, hello. It's Brandy Janae here. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. I would like to welcome you if you are new and welcome you back if you're returning. I truly appreciate your support. In today's video, I am going to be doing a Dollar Tree haul. I know it's been a minute, but they have some super cool things today when I was out at the store. So I decided just to show you what I found in case you haven't been to Dollar Tree in a while. So if you're interested in seeing what's inside this Dollar Tree haul, please be sure to stay tuned. All right, great. Thank you again so much for tuning in with me today. Like I said in my intro, I will be doing a very quick Dollar Tree haul. I honestly haven't been to Dollar Tree in a while other than looking for like very specific things. So yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I was still mad when it went to the Dollar 25 tree. And so I just kind of been staying away a little bit to be perfectly honest with you. But today I decided I had some extra time. I'm gonna run in here and just see if there's anything cool I can find. And besides, I just finished watching another Dollar Tree haul from Simply Shantae Renee. And yeah, it got me thinking like, hmm, maybe I could use those things too. So because of her video, I went and grabbed some of these glass wipes. I have not tried them yet, but she says they're really good. And I know her very well and I trust her. So I went ahead and picked them up. But for 160 wipes for $1.25, I'm here for it. It's definitely worth trying. I plan on using these primarily in my bathroom with those mirrors because I get so tired of the spraying and the paper towels and just, it's a lot. So hopefully these work very well in the bathroom. If they do, then I will go ahead and pick up another set because it will be cool to have a set that I keep in the car to clean off those car windows as needed. So glass wipes so i'm kind of i do kind of have this split up which i don't think i said so i'm going to start off with like the home type stuff and then i have another little bit of like stationary type things so glass then i also found which i know is not new but i could not find one forever so it's the broom the mop and broom holder i'm not really sure again if these things even work but for $1.25, it was worth a try. I do keep my broom and mop in my laundry room. And sometimes I trip over it. <laughs> so hopefully this will actually work. And I can get those things off of the floor. Especially the broom. I'm sorry, especially the dustpan. Because it's the most annoying. Then I found this little container, which is my, which is by Sure Fresh. Now, what made this container cool? Because it's it's just a container, like whatever. But what made this container cool for me was the removable ice pack. So I felt like this would be really good for storing like my fruit and little things like that that I like to carry. Maybe even some like cheese or whatever because of the ice pack. So I thought that was super cool. Coral is my sorority color, so I'm naturally drawn to that color. So yeah but we'll try this for lunch then i also found these socks made by peds which i feel like peds is like a big brand but i could be wrong but anyway these are some of those like no show no slip heel socks whatever they're really good for like when i'm wearing chucks or other low even like my booties and things like that so there's a four pack for a dollar 25 couldn't beat it if they're amazing i'm gonna try to run back up there and get another pack because again why not and yeah so hopefully they're awesome but i didn't want to go out and get a whole bunch of them and then i hated them and then i just have a whole bunch of socks just laying around so i just got one pack we know how dollar tree is though so i may go back and they're gone forever but eh, we'll see then I also got these clips, which again, may not be new to most of you, but because I haven't been there in a while, I haven't seen them. So it comes with a pack of three and they're great for storage. If you know me, then you know I'm kind of a chip junkie. Like that's probably my greatest weakness. <laughs> so I just have all these random like chip bags open all the time. So I felt like having more clips on hand is awesome. And then I really like these. Like I've bought these before 
and I really like them. They're just a great toothbrush, especially if you're traveling. And I love that they come with the caps already. So I just got a couple more packs of these. I just like them in the house. They're, I like to use them. I love to travel with them. And then, you know, if ever we have any guests or whatever come over that don't have toothbrushes, I always like to just have extra. Not that I have a lot of guests, but you know, you never know what could happen. And then speaking of traveling, I thought these were really nice. The travel size soaps, which I don't know if I've ever seen like a, you know, name brand soaps in Dollar Tree before. So I went ahead and picked up two of these. Again, I just keep them on hand. I have travel soap, but you just never know when you might need an extra one. So the Olay, which I thought was really cool. And then Ivory, which is one of my favorite soap brands in general. And then they also had this Odaban, which is a dis disinfectant. I have not seen this one, but this one apparently is a dif disinfectant fabric and air freshener. So I'm looking forward to trying this. I hadn't really heard of Odaban before. And then someone at my former job mentioned it and how awesome it was for antibacterial stuff. So when I saw these, I was like, oh, well, I'm going to go ahead and pick this up because why not? We always need things to be cleaned. So I can use these around the house and then I'll probably take a bottle to work as well to just spray down those soft surfaces um, that are touched pretty frequently in my office. So here we go. And then for my kitchen, I thought these were super cute. Life is a beautiful ride. So this is this burner cover set. Y'all, this is one of the things me and my husband fight about regularly because he doesn't notice <laughs> when he spilled things in the burner and I always end up being the one to see it and it drives me crazy. So hopefully these cute little burners will cover up the burners and then I don't have to worry about the little things that get stuck on the inside. I should have gotten these a long time ago. I don't know why I haven't, but I thought these were really cute. So I picked that up. And then they also had the pot holders to match. And then they had the kitchen towel to match. So I just thought the set was super cute. Doesn't really match anything in my kitchen other than my, what do I have? I think I have, my ninja is in this color. <laughs> but it's cute. So I went with it and I really like bikes. And hopefully that my husband sees this regularly. It'll be a subconscious message because he was supposed to be getting me a bike last bike riding season and he didn't so this is kind of also a subconscious keep my kitchen clean and don't forget to buy your wife a bike message oh gotta love those messages all right and then i also found these little mini scrapers which of course are great for just cleaning off gunk from things but then for me I have been seeing a lot of YouTubers use these to cut their washi tape. So I was like, Psh, getting it. So um, yeah, comes with a four pack, super cool. I don't know if I have these already, but I figured, I mean, you can't really have too many. So this is a four pack. And then also I purchased a while back, I, well, not a while, a while back as in a couple weeks ago, I did happen to run in Dollar Tree for a thing and then ended up coming out with oh I went looking for the pegboards and I did find it which is super cute and I'll insert a clip of those now that I have it all kind of put together but I did find a matter of fact pause let me just show you what I went ahead and did with my pegboards I thought it was super cute I just grabbed four little ones and then added the accessories and I keep this here by my desk so that when I am filming, I can have those things accessible. And that is what I use the pegboards for. But while I was there, they had those Zebra Sarasa pins. So if you check out my Instagram, you'll see the ones that I already purchased and I already did like a writing test. So I know that I really like them. So I went ahead and grabbed a couple more today. These are the fine liner pins. And so I grabbed this green, the deep pink, and then the blue. So these are some fine liner pins in the 0 0.8 millimeter needle point. And then they also had, which I haven't tried this, but this is a mechanical pencil. 
with black ink. Now they did have mechanical pencils in different color inks, but I was like, mm, when would I really use a different colored ink mechanical pencil? Probably not ever. So I just went ahead and stuck with the black. So anyway, I figure these are great. Again, you can't beat a dollar twenty-five. I know the Sarasa is a you know expensive brand, and you know at one of the craft stores is probably way more than a dollar twenty-five each. So I thought this was a great deal. If I don't use them, it'll definitely be something that I can add to like a planner bag or a stationary bundle or something that I give away. And then I went ahead and picked up another one of these because, again, watching the YouTube, I see a lot of the planner girls using these to pick up their stickers. I have one that's made by Cricut, but because I use it for vinyl, it is very, like, gunky. <laughs> and so I went ahead and just grabbed one from Dollar Tree because they all work the same. So these are really good tools to use for cleaning, picking up the stickers once you lay them down if you decide you want to move them. So if you don't have one of these, run to the dollar 25 tree. I think they should change the name and grab you one. And then I also picked up these because I am a very bougie pencil user. I think that comes with years and years and years and years of being an educator, but this Thai Condoroga pencil is my absolute favorite. I'm not sure about this renew wooden recycled type deal, but I assume they still work the same. So I went ahead and grabbed a pack of these. I actually grabbed like four packs of these because I'm going to give, I'm going to keep a pack because I just love having pencils around. And then I'm going to give the other three away to one of my little friends because she's going to get these other things. And so it's kind of going to start her back to school little bag. And so for her, cause she's so cute. I found this cute little pencil cup and I really thought about getting it for myself, but I couldn't justify it. So because I really wanted to buy it, I decided to go ahead and add this to some of the little stuff. I try to remember. I don't think last um, back to school that I remember to give her things, even though I collected all year. <laughs> so my bad. But this year I do have some things put aside that I plan on giving her. And I will add this cute little pencil cup because I thought it was precious. And it really doesn't even have to be a pencil cup. Like I could totally see this in a little girl's bathroom or just on their desk to hold, I don't know, little girl stuff. But I just thought it was super cute. And I really, really, really wanted it. But I'm like, you're a grown up. You're a grown up. Don't do it. You don't even need it. You have already a thousand pencil holders. You don't even need it. So I'm just going to live vicariously through her. But to match that, they have this little container. Oh my gosh, it's so precious. And so it has the three small compartments and then the one bigger one. So again, just a cute little, to me, girl, desk organization, whether it's stuck in a locker at school or even at home. They also had one that was dinosaurs. So freaking precious. It was like a gray color with the dinosaurs. I almost bought it, but again, I'm like, what are you going to do with it? Stop buying stuff you don't need just because it's cute. And then they had avocados, which I absolutely love, but I couldn't find all the pieces of the avocado and I was mad. So I just didn't get that. Now the avocados, I probably would have kept um, <laughs> just because. All right. Sorry about that. My husband decided to call in the middle of my video. Rude. So, and then the last thing I picked up with this super cute pencil pouch that matches and yeah, I think she's gonna like it. Now, obviously I don't think these pencils will fit in here, but hopefully some other little pencils or markers or whatever, crayons, whatever, will fit in here and she can just use it because it's cute. So anyway, that is the haul for today. Thank you all so, so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification button so you can be notified anytime I post a new video. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, have a good day, friends. Goodbye.